Ambassador Rajit, we touched upon Taiwan right now. Um, recently, uh, China has, as of late, uh, they've been sounding belligerent again towards them. They do that all the time. Are they being serious? You know, so is this just brink much? No, no, no. This is posturing. Um, 1962, that Mao Zedong fellow attacked us because his great leap forward uh, had killed 50 million Chinese. He had said we'd become the most industrialized nation in the world in five years. So you start producing steel in your backyard and you give up agriculture and let's all run off to industry. It was a total disaster. So he attacked us. Then there was uh, this issue about um, the cultural revolution, which was tearing apart China's inner. So in 69, he attacked the former Soviet Union. Then there was this thing about political instability with a character called Deng Xiaoping. And he said that Mao's widow and uh, she was a part of the gang of four that is threatening me. So he attacked Vietnam and got slapped tightly for it. So now they feel in 2020, when they had their own internal issues about a declining population, a tanking economy, um, soil deterioration, they had their major water issues and what have you. And then they decided to attack us, thinking we were a pushover. Now, if you feel that he's going to attack Taiwan, there isn't a chance. In there. Unless, unless Shri Ping Pong, or whatever that fellow's name is, who runs China, unless he's on auto destruct, they're not going to do it. They don't have the courage. And this is not the world of 1949. This is 2022. China doesn't have a friend in the world. There may be somebody who says, oh, I love you. Give me some money. And then when the Chinese say, give me back the money, they say, oh, I hate you. So, you know, it's, it's not going to work. I'm totally convinced. It's nice to talk about it. It's nice for countries that want to increase their defense budgets, which are involved in this. Oh, China is going to attack, so I need to spend more money. It's not required. They don't have the cuts. The people of China don't want it. They're sick and tired. They are looked upon uh, with, with suspicion. I always say India is respected. China is suspected. I don't want to be a citizen of a country that is suspected. Please remember to subscribe to us and switch on the notifications for this channel. For our other social media links, more content and to support our work, please visit citti.net. Dhanavad, Namaskar.